this is a patient in which we are going to perform an elbow arthroscopic surgery. Elbow arthroscopic surgery basically is performed in a lateral decubitus position and we should make ensure that we can just do a little bit of flexion and extension while doing the procedure. Most of the procedure will be done in about 90 degrees of flexion. Now as far as the elbow joint is concerned, uh, the most important thing you need to take care is about the nerves. Because this is one joint where the nerves are very close to your portals. So you should be very very careful and you should be very particular in the surface marking of your nerves, that is number one. And whenever you are making a portal, you have to just make a skin portal. You do not have to make a deep portal with the uh, knife. And you can just dilate the portal with your eye. This is very important. Now, grossly the elbow joint has two components. The first component is an interior component and the second component is the posterior compartment. The interior compartment of the elbow joint is you have you actually have two portals. One is the proximal medial portal and proximal lateral portal. Now the important point is all your portals for the interior compartment are more safer proximally as compared to this, this for both for medial and lateral. So your portals should be more proximally as compared to distally. This is specifically true for the lateral side because the, on the lateral side the nerve, the radial and the PIN nerve will be closer on the distal aspect. So it is better to make your portals more proximally. So for the anterior compartment if we talk you can make proximally anterior medial portal first locating and you have to go anterior to the medial anterior, uh, intermuscular septum to go into the joint initially and then you can make the lateral portal under vision and that too you have to try to make it more proximally as compared to distal. So if you talk about the lateral compartment you can make a prox uh, proximal portal, you can make a, almost a lateral portal but the distal lateral portal is an unsafe portal and if you can avoid it, avoid making it. So distal lateral portal usually you should not make. The position of ulna now you should all know and if the patient has uh, any surgery which has the position of ulna which has shifted then you should avoid doing a, a blind incision for the portal. So in that case you may have to make a small incision, locate the nerve and then make a portal. So suppose that the anterior transposition of the nerve has been done or any other nerve procedure has been done and you are not able to palpate the nerve then it is always better, safer to not uh, approach it blind. So that is very important. So as far as the anterior comport, uh, compartment goes, anterior um, medial portal, lateral portal and try to keep both portals more proximally as compared to distally. That is the for the anterior compartment. So the, for the lateral compartment, uh, for the posterior compartment, it is relatively safer. So you have a good safe zone on the lateral aspect. So if you talk about this is the olecranon, this is the radial head. You can see the radial head and palpate the radial head by doing a uh, supination pronation movement. And the medial side you have a ulnar nerve, but the lateral side, this particular area is safe. So if you see this area, you are almost safe up to here to here. So this, you have a broad margin of safety on the posterior lateral aspect. So here, what you can do is you can make portals. So the three portals that I usually use is one portal, which is on the, which is a mid tricep portal. So this is one portal, which I will make a mid tricep portal. Then you can use a posterior lateral portal and then you can use a lateral portal or I also call it as a radio capital portal. So this everything will be in the safe zone because the nerve will be anterior. Okay, so posterior laterally it is relatively safe. You should go, uh, uh, try to go, avoid going, going beyond the midline on the middle side. But you can make a mid tricep portal that is a safe portal, posterior lateral portal and a lateral radio capital portal. portal. So, these, uh, if you uh, take all these considerations into the mind, then most of your uh, uh, nerves will be safe. The other thing is, whenever you are doing an elbow arthroscopy, you should be very careful about the indications you are doing. So don't uh, jump on to very heavy or very, very difficult indications initially, because there is a documented chances of nerve palsy, which is much more in elbow as compared to any other joint. So you will need to uh, search out your indications and do it accordingly. Okay, so let's start with the procedure. When we start the procedure, we will first inflate the joint with 20 cc of saline. So, and again, this we have to do it in the posterior lateral compartment because this is the safest point. This is